Hello, family. Thank you for coming over to the house tonight. And just kick off your shoes and relax your feet. Party on down to the SKB. We're kicking. Just kick it. Just kick it. Okay, you don't come to another episode where we're going to be asking the question of... Why are you telling my business? Don't be telling my business. Hmm. Why not? Because a can-can and a can-can, a can-can, a can-can, and a wheel. Now we're off to... Hello, everyone, and thank you for coming back to the channel. I think I had a... Something was going on with my... Um, video I think I'm not really sure but this is the clip that I was playing before that Simon trying to elevate himself to and I guess he's thinking he's doing a very good job at it but I was like oh my goodness so what we're going to do is let me see if I can get it to play again but this is the video of actual um what simon had posted on his instagram account regarding how he feels about porsche and he would literally hurt anybody if they came in the way of them being together i guess you would say but here we go Her 86, 87 when the song came out. Then God gave her back to me in 2005. I put her name on the back, man. You, you understand me? That's mine right there. Yeah, I own you and you own me. I will kill everybody in here about your ass. Please understand that about the way I love you, Marjorie Elaine. You understand me? I kill everybody in here. I swear to God, I will. You can ask the Lord about me. I'll kill every. had a moment I'm... and that's me and my wife's song too I met her 86 87 when the song came out then God gave her back to me in 2005 I put her name on the back man you, you understand me that's mine right there yeah I own you and you own me I will kill everybody in here about your ass. Please understand that about the way I love you, Marjorie Elaine. You understand me? I kill everybody in here. I swear to God I will. You can ask the Lord about me. I'll kill every <laughs> Rescued and changed my life. I just had a moment. I'm... And that's me and my wife's song, too. I met her 86, 87 when the song came out. Then God gave her back to me in 2005. I put her name on the back, man. You, you understand me. That's mine right there. Yeah. was like okay uh is would he be the same way would he have the same energy about Portia would he get up and tell everybody in a crowd 
that he feels the same way like Steve is expressing himself uh, about his wife I think her fourth wife Marjorie or does he wants to get with Steve Harvey's wife Marjorie which one is he saying family do you think he wants or he is admiring admiring and kind of on a down low uh, wanting to be with Steve Harvey's wife you know I'm reaching you know I'm reaching but I was like wait a minute now we can look at this in two different ways it could be he is you know comparing him and Portia to Marjorie and Steve and what he would get up and do and say in front of people making a fool out of himself of course but share, sharing his undying love for his girlfriend glorified you know supposed to be his wife and he done named her everything like she's some kind of pet. But I know in their culture, you know, they give it, it's a tradition from what I understand. And it's proper in their culture. But I'm like, Simon, Portia ain't in your culture, honey. And she, if y'all left here today and broke up, Portia be right there either trying to get another African or she'll be trying to get a white man or Asian man or another black man, honey. It doesn't matter with Portia. She just goes for the gusto and she goes for what she think is the highest bidder on the highest paid millionaire or billionaire. That's why you in her life. You really think she was attracted to you, sir? Do you really think she was attracted to you? No, she was attracted to your bank account. Same way Marjorie, and it's just my opinion, it's all allegedly. Marjorie was attracted to Steve Harvey for his money. Because I think she came in between him and his last wife from what i understand and then he stronghold bullied to get his son away from her and to come live with him and i'm like who does that what kind of man does that so i've been fell out with steve Hart. I, hell i fell out with him uh when bernie mac got sick and it was allegedly that he had something to do with Bernie Mac's career as well as his, him dying so I don't know I was allegedly you know I'm a conspiracy theory, conspiracy theory person around here so I kind of look at every angle that you can possibly think of I'm not like one thought trained okay so I'm blessed to be able to see several sides and then I just deduce it for my own personal benefit with reasoning and logic and i come up with my own conclusion okay not saying i'm right all the time but i ain't saying i'm wrong either okay it's just an opinion but i just thought that was weird i said well you know what he could be thinking he him and portia uh are very similar and he could relate to marjorie and um steve's relationship or he could be on the down low really fiending and wanting to be with marjorie I'm saying, well, uh, if you want to do that, you're going to have to rub a little bit higher elbows and play a little bit more golf with some more professional people that can probably get you in the rim or on the cusp of maybe accidentally meeting uh, Marjorie. Because she does live in Atlanta, so I think you need to be following her social media account. And then you can kind of see her comings and goings. And then, not stalking now, just admiring Simon. Don't stalk lady you could probably see where she's going to be hanging out at so you can like arbitrarily bump into each other which i don't know because like i said you're not verified yet and uh we have yet to see uh what you're really worth you know what i'm saying uh -huh, so <laughs> you keep dreaming simon you keep dreaming okay but uh, you can't turn a porsche into a madre even though they may have similar ways meaning gold digging ways uh but <laughs> you probably just better just lay low for a while just lay low brother okay uh, or get married to porsche do something out the ordinary because right now you're becoming to be a little bit predictive and you want shine okay i understand that got it good but if you really want to do something that would set the internet and social media ablaze go on and get married to portia that would be a good thing then we could just talk about that and see the comings and goings of you know, you all living together and co-parenting together 
traveling together because she's trying to make some moves now, Simon. You, you can't be on your respirator. You can't be lugging around your oxygen tank. You can't be sitting outside smoking cigars now. You got to put on your running your track shoes. You got to be a runner, a track star now, okay? Uh, because she's trying to get in that Hollywood setting, that Hollywood lifestyle, uh, sir. So you're going to have to be a little bit more active because she's going to be coming and going unless you're going to let her do her thing and you wait patiently at home for her to come back okay because we already know when a, a job opportunity come and she can be seen in the public in a different light a more positive light she leaving everybody she leaving her baby she leaving you she leaving her family and she going to pursue her dreams now you would have thought Portia would have did all this prior to having a child <coughs> excuse me for having a child and trying to be in a meaningful relationship such as a marriage but now Portia just go at every whim she 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 just like flows like water of a, on a faucet when you're turning it on you know she she just don't think she, and, and she has no longevity to things she's like a spur of the moment type chick free vibes you know what i'm saying and at 40 41 i think she's 40 but we, we gonna give her 41 because we're almost out of the year anyway she should have a little bit more forethought, forethought into pursuing different things and put family first. Well, put the Lord first, then your family, and then everything will be crystal clear. You see what I'm saying? Because she has a foundation. But lately, it don't seem like her foundation is rocking too well with the Lord. Okay, it's more so the devil. So, I don't know what that realm feels like or, or how it does or whatever, but... That's where it seems like she's running for that money, that power, that idolization part or piece that you get when you're a uh, uh, well-known, relatable, or not relatable, celebrity out there, okay? She don't forget about being a reality star. She wants to be an actress, a well-paid actress now. Like I said, we ain't got no problems with her trying to evolve into another person positive person hopefully and to harness more skill sets we got we have no problem with that but it's just how she implements it it's, it's just how she puts it in motion that we have issues with okay but that's all i got for this video guys i thought i would share that with you all because i plugged in the wrong pictures is what i did <laughs> I should have been plugging on these pictures, which would have been following more to what the audio was giving us. But, you know, I couldn't do my family like that. I, I had to come correct. I had to come correct and straight so y'all know what's going on, okay? But like it, love, we got to have more. Get down in those comments. Y'all tell me. Y'all think Simon like uh, Marjorie Harvey. Do you think he like Marjorie Harvey? Or he's trying to make Portia emulate Marjorie Har Harvey. I don't know. Both of them are gold diggers. So they got one phase already shut down. Okay. <laughs> or locked down I should say. But we'll see y'all next video. Y'all take care. Bye bye.